Having knocked out all the response videos regarding my stance on the LRO, this leaves me with various non-LRO arguments to focus on. One of them is the fact that the lunar module didn't leave a blast crater where its 3,000 pound thrust engine had fired. Scientists incorrectly attributed the sunlit portion of these natural impact craters to being discoloration by the engine plume, and we know that such an engine should have dug a hole in the ground. Once again, the lunar module didn't leave a disturbance visible from space, and it didn't leave a blast crater. Down at four. Give me one click up. You're backing up slightly. Okay, two down. Stand by for contact. I'm gonna let her down. You level off. Let her on down. Okay, seven, six percent. Plenty fat. Contact. Stop. We established that the Chandrayaan 1 photos merely show only the same brightly lit craters photographed by LRO and Cellini. And the Apollo 15 shots were supposedly taken from different angles and subsequently wouldn't show the same degree of illumination from the crater. Plume. And we know that such an engine should have dug a hole in the ground. Okay, they can confirm your lens cover's off. Uh, the scissors are in. Copy that. Lens brushes. I hope this is the right study. Uh, it is. <laughs> they try, uh, F56, uh, directly down sun, uh, or up sun, at that sculptured hill there in the, uh, the distance. See what I mean? Yeah, I get it. Okay, Bob, uh, what else do I need here? Let's see, 500, mag R, need mag R. Finish through. Yeah, I think we got enough of those now, team. Then I, you got the map? 
Yep, got him. Some of these won't overlap, Bob, because I'm hurrying. Don't, don't smear them. Don't, don't hurry and smear them. They're not smeared, but I just didn't overlap some of them. Okay, everyone agrees to that. Don't hurry and smear them. <laughs> I'll get those others, Jack, tomorrow. John, 89. Okay, the boat switch is going to one. Okay, and John, when you get inside, we have a configuration change in the LRV. Okay. 